Behind Senna is Gerhard Berger. Behind Patrese is his teammate Bootsen. Fifth on the grid on the left-hand side is Alain Prost. And in sixth position is Nigel Mansell. So, watch the back of the grid and you'll see somebody with a green flag and away they go. Now, Berger trying to come through but Patrese is taking the lead, is he? No, Senna's holding it and Berger is trying to sprint through on the inside of the automatic gearbox Ferrari and Patrese goes through, Berger spins and has lost part of the car. Senna is being passed, Senna is down to fourth, down to fifth. It's Patrese leading, up into third position has come Bootsen. So the Williams are well away but they have problems with overheating, but Patrese is fairly scorching away. Fantastic opening lap. Well, I must say, that was uh, pretty stupid driving, really, for two of the Grand Prix Racing's most experienced drivers, Senna and Berger. Berger's case is more understandable. He needed a moment of glory because the Ferrari is not expected to last the distance. They've had a lot of problems with their gearbox, and here we see from the Williams, on-board camera, an action replay view of the start. And unfortunately, our screen got a bit... The lens got a bit misted and steamed up there. But uh, you just were able to see Berger's Ferrari spinning off on the outside. Bit of an end plate of the wing, I think it was, came adrift. But really, it's very short-sighted stuff. That one, and Bootsen is up into second position. So the Williams-Renault leads, and a Williams-Renault is second. And out of the race is Gerhard Berger on lap one. So that's one Ferrari out for a reason they did not expect. They were not confident that the gearbox was going to last, that the electronics would go the race. Uh, that problem has been resolved, but in quite the wrong way. And at the end of lap one, it is in the lead. Riccardo Patrese in his 177th Grand Prix. Thierry Bootsen is in second place. And up into third position in the second McLaren, has in the second Ferrari, has come Nigel Mansell. Nigel Mansell then, from sixth position on the grid, has come up into a storming third position. And he'll be really going for it. He's had an engine change, and into the pits comes 